Hello, welcome to Eckert Yoga. My name is Olaf, and today we're going to do Mayurasana or a peacock pose. I will uh, demonstrate this more advanced position first, and then we'll go into the details. We'll start off in cat position. Even though this is a preparatory pose, it's important to give attention to this pose as well, because it's the foundation of Mayurasana. So make sure the fingers are spread, you feel the palms of the hands touching the earth. Now move the forehead between the hands, roll on the top of the head, extend the arms to the back, keep the fingers spread apart, pull the hands back in, elbows together. Now walk or place the feet all the way back. Make sure the elbows are making firm contact with the belly. Just above the belly button, the navel. Now you can intensify the pose first by looking forward, lifting up the head like this. If you're comfortable with this, then you can slowly lift up one and eventually both legs like this. Maybe first the left leg. The right leg. And eventually find your balance, move slightly forward. Keep breathing. So, this is Mayurasana. Now, we're going into the details a bit deeper. What is important is the position of the hands and the elbows. Especially for girls, it is important to make more or less a scooping motion with the arms, the elbows touching each other, make sure the fingers, the palms of the hands are stretched out. So the elbows make a deep contact with the abdomen, with the belly button. It is normal that the elbows may slip a bit apart. It's not troublesome, but if you notice that you keep on slipping away, try to place the hands a bit further apart. Okay, we'll do it again. First, into a cat position, Bidalasana. Move the head down, the forehead resting between the hands, roll to the top of the head. Extend the arms back. Move the arms bit in, now make the scooping motion a bit further so you find a good position for the hands already pressing mildly into the abdomen now extend the legs look up and again find your balance You can stay in this position for as long as you like. In the initial stages of this position, a lot of attention goes to the pressure on the abdomen. But also when you feel more and more comfortable with the pose, try to extend your awareness, not only to the abdomen, but also the position of the hands, the feet, the legs, the awareness of the elongation of the spine. This will 
surely help you to deepen this pose for you. One more variation. If you're comfortable with this position, Padmasana, you can also do Mayurasana in a Padmasana position. It's called Padma Mayurasana or Lotus Peacock Pose. The build-up is exactly the same, only now the legs remain in the full lotus position. For most people this is already an advanced position to sit in this asana for a couple of minutes. Okay, back to cat position. Again, Move the forehead between the hands. Roll to the top of the head. Extend the arms all the way to the back. Make the scooping motion, elbows touching. Now look up and lift up. Keep on breathing. Lower the legs, stretch out the arms. And all the way back to Padmasana. From here on you can do other asanas or continue your practice. Thank you for watching, see you next time.